morning fog yet to completely lift, so we're left with overcast skies here at Oracle Park. Today, a contest from the NL West division between the L.A. Dodgers and the San Francisco Giants. We've got baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Kevin Gossman gets the start for San Francisco in this one. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, Matt, we're getting a chance to look at a guy that added a new pitch to his repertoire, the split finger. He won't throw it that often. I think one of the reasons he tried to pick up this pitch had a difficult time throwing the straight changeup, and sometimes the splitter is the quick pitch fix for that. So it'll be interesting to see how and when he uses the splitter in this one here today. First pitch on its way. Mookie Betts is in to start things off as he looks at a ball to start the inning 1 and 0. First pitch, 4 o'clock. Here's the pitch. A ball and a strike. 65 degrees our temperature here at first pitch. One and two. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. So next to bat will be Corey Seeger. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. Yastrzemski is back to the warning track, and he's able to put it away for the second out. Time now to check out the lineup for the visiting Dodgers. How do they go about taking down their division rival, Mark DeRosa? Well, Matty, if I could tell this lineup one thing, it would be let's get on this guy early. Day game in this ballpark. The sun starts glaring, starts getting later in the day. Those shadows start creeping in right around the time that bullpen starts getting warmed up. Got to find a way to scratch a few across early. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Into the bleachers and gone! So a solo shot here to left center field, and the Dodgers strike first, one to nothing. What a way to get things started while playing on the road. Top of the first and a big fly, just like that, they take the lead. And that'll bring up the versatile Max Muncy as he takes a cold strike at the knees. It's 0-1. Two out, nobody on. Late decision to swing that time, and as a result, it's 0-2. I know this guy has a lot of weapons on the mound, but what makes him so successful is that he's aggressive in the zone, getting ahead, forcing action. And a half-hearted swing there as they tie him up inside for the third strike, and the inning is over. But the Dodgers are on the board first thanks to this solo home run. Home half of the first coming up from McCovey Cove. And L.A.'s off to an early 1-0 lead. Clayton Kershaw gets the start for Los Angeles in this one. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, this ought to be fun to watch in this one here today. A guy with over 2,000 career strikeouts. Think about it. He knows how to get swings and misses, and he knows how to paint the corners. Hopefully, he'll bring some of that in this one here, and he should be fun to watch. Stepping up is Mike Talkman. He'll lead Here's things off here in the bottom down. half of the first. The left fielder, Mike Talkman. Kershaw into the windup. Here it comes. 
Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. Softly hit toward the hole. Scooped up. And there's one down now. And here's a look at the hometown Giants starting lineup in this one. Mark, what's your take on him against one of the best starters in the game? Yeah, Matty, a lot of professional at bats up and down this lineup. I know they're behind right now, but it only takes one guy to set the tone and get the boys going. Mike Yastrzemski digging in at the plate. As he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. His lifetime numbers against Kershaw. He's got a three for seven line. He's taken him deep once. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. And it's fouled away. One out, nobody on. That misses one and two. Man, that's a good take there on that 0 2 fastball just missed. He must have a really good eye at the plate. Weak grounder back to the mound. Throw on to first to take care of him, and Kershaw is in control now, two away. Batting third, the catcher, Buster Posey. Next to hit is Buster Posey. Looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. And the pitch. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. Now the slider gets the call in the bottom part of the zone. Bases are empty here with two men out. And he lays off for a ball two and one. He's fallen behind now three and one. Into the windup and the pitch. And a check swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. And strike three called as he says, You gotta be kidding me with the side retired. So they breeze through this half of the inning. Second inning now from San Francisco. Dodgers out in front, one to nothing. New inning set to get underway, and that brings up Will Smith. The catcher, Will Smith. And now the first pitch. Back up the middle. And a base hit, so early trouble to lead off the inning. There's a hard hit ground ball pitcher not able to get a glove on it hard single up the middle. Yeah watch your lips right there dad sent it back right where it came from. In now Chris Taylor. 
as he lifts it in the air to right field. Yastrzemski's got it, and there's one gone. Okay, here's how San Francisco lines up defensively. And let's focus our attention on third baseman Evan Longoria. Multiple gold glove winner. This guy has ice water in, in his veins. He, he never lets on. You can't tell if this guy's on fire or he's struggling. He's one of the most consistent defenders in our sport. So now to the plate. A.J. Pollock. As he'll watch a slider that runs out of the strike zone away for ball one. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. And that's in there for his strike one and one. So let's take a peek at the umpire and crew in this one. Behind the plate is Matthew Ross. Hey, Dero, this is a pitcher's best friend. Matthew Ross, very wide strike zone. Yeah, no excuses from the offense today. You know coming in when you see the lineup card and Matt Ross is behind the dish, you better be aggressive. Two balls and a strike now. Two and two. Now a throw over to first, and he just manages to get his hand in. Dodgers have the early 1-0 advantage as we play the second. And the fastball misses high and away there. It's full 3-2. and two. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3-2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at, and if not, it's ball four anyways. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there, two away. Really good late bite on that slider right there. The best ones have that late action that just darts at the last minute. They're so tough to get the bat on, and when you've got that good slider going, it's a great strikeout pitch. batter will be Gavin Lux as he'll take a called strike here on a borderline pitch at strike one. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. The 0 1 pitch grounded softly to the right. He's got it. And he will make it to the bag a step ahead of the runner and that ends the inning. Dodgers leave one and after an inning and a half it's one to nothing. Here's the first baseman Brandon Bell His lifetime numbers against Kershaw he's sold him four hits in 62 ABs and he's walked away a strikeout victim 30 times. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And a high strike to begin the at bat. It's 0 and 1. Kershaw has a reputation as a strike thrower, although that doesn't often result in a ton of strikeouts. A typical start may find him with a low walk total and the ball in play a lot. Matty, he's what they call today one of those pitch to contact kind of guys. He has good stuff, not great stuff. He relies a lot on his defense and one of the keys. He's not afraid to throw the ball in the strike zone. With that said, he needs some defense behind it because he's not going to get a whole lot of swings and misses. I mean, he's coming right after him, Matty. Three fastballs in a row. Kershaw's ready. Here's the one two. Fastball called strike three, and there's the first out of the inning. Batting fifth. And stepping in, Evan Longoria. Longoria. Pitch on the way. Now here's the pitch.
Bases are empty, one man out. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Into the windup and the pitch. Dribbled down the third baseline. He'll try again, one, two. Two and two. Too high, and that cost him ball four. Batting six. Not shortstop. Brandon. Next, it'll be Crawford. Brandon Crawford. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. He's set. Here it comes. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. A dive, but he can't knock it down. It's through for a base hit. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one out single. Check out the lefty as he absolutely jumps on that first pitch and hammers it to right. Got what he was looking for and put a good swing on it. Standing in now, Wilmer Flores. As Kershaw will get the upper hand here with strike one. And he's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Here's the 0 1 pitch. Behind 0 and 2 now. Started the breaking ball far too inside that time. Laid off for ball one. Back to back sliders in on the hands. He didn't handle it real well at all on the previous pitch. So why not come right back with it again. Better job of laying off that one though. The one two. Fouled away. Here's another one, two. Line toward the alley in left center. And he won't get it as that's down for a base hit. And to score is the runner from third. It's one to one. Nice job in the box right there. Just a professional clean A.B. Didn't cheat to anything. A lot of guys could have rolled that foul down the line. Not the case right here. Kept his hands back, stayed calm, and delivered a nice base hit. So that brings up the outfielder, Austin Slater. Dribbled to the right side. Crawford on second. Flores at first, one gone. In the dirt. Throw to third. And oh, they say he beat the throw safe at third. So now two men in scoring position. Well, you live by the sword, you die by it too. He went with an off speed pitch down in the zone, and that's the risk you take there. The catcher can't come up with it, and two runners advance. Now they're both into scoring position. 
Runners are at second and third with one down. Hit the other way out toward right field. Betts has a read on it. He gets there to make the catch, but this should bring home a run as the runner tags from third. And the run is in to score from third. It's now a two to one ball game. Always productive to score runs when you can. And that sacrifice fly right there drives home the second run of the inning. And now the Giants pitcher, Kevin Gossman, runner in scoring position with two gone. First offering. Here's a fastball on the inner third taken for a strike. Fouled off. Hey, I know it's the pitcher at the plate, but he's going to grind it out right here. He's got a chance to help himself, and nothing's a bigger backbreaker to a team than watching the pitcher drive in a run. The pause and the 0 2. Frozen on the fastball, never had a chance, and the inning is over. So it's two runs on two hits, no errors, and a runner left. We played two full. It's the Giants two and the Dodgers one. All set for the start of the inning and up next will be the pitcher the Clayton pitcher. Kershaw. Clayton Kershaw. From the stretch here's the pitch. Well, oh, that's a nasty breaking ball right there. Backdoor slider just missed the corner. As they say, that's a Hall of Fame pitch. The 1 0. Misses ball two. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. 2 0 count. Here it comes. Grounded to third. Up with it is Longoria. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. The batter, the right fielder, Mickey Bet. So it's back to the top of the order now. And up next, one of the terrific talents in the game, Mookie Betts. Here's the first pitch to him. Oh, and he just blows the fastball by him for strike one. Hey, when you're featuring a mid 90s fastball like this pitcher, attack with that pitch. Get ahead. Get the offense on their toes. That opens up the off speed pitches later in the game. Here's the 0 and 2. One ball, two strikes. Yeah. A 2 to 1 score here as we play inning number three. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. Lined in the right, a base hit. Many guys fall victim to the breaking ball and want to get out in front of it, and they end up rolling it over to the pull side. Batter was able to execute, stay inside, keep his hands back, and drive it the other way. Next at the plate will be Corey Seager as he looks at a fastball that's in there for strike one. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Ready with the 0 1.
Runner at first here, one man out. All even now, two and two. And he fouls this one off. Won't commit on the slider. Good patience, and it's full three and two. I don't even think I need to look in the dugout on this one. I think it's safe to assume he's going to be running. Too good a hitter at the plate not to think he's going to put the ball in play. The three two pitch. And there he goes towards second. A shot down the first baseline. Eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. And he lays off here. A nice job. It's ball four. First and second now with one away. Up next to the Striding in is Justin Turner. The base knock to the outfield could score the tying run from second. First pitch of the A.B. now. Perfect time for a mound visit right here. Just give him a breather, a chance to collect himself and get back to work. The 1-0. Misses for the second ball. Great chance right here as a hitter to be really aggressive. With two guys already on, pretty good shot. He's going to get a challenge pitch right here. Now the 2-0. Hit softly down the line at first. But this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Betts over at second. Seeger is over at first with one away. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Popped up. Belt able to pull this one in for route number two. Now back the first baseman, Max Muncy. Next up is Max Muncy trying here to plate the tying run from second. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Popped him up. Posey is there. And the inning is over. Dodgers strand a couple. They're down 2 1. Now back to the leadoff spot in the Giants lineup. Stepping forward, Mike Talkman. He'll be the one to start things here against Clayton Kershaw. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. And he popped him up. Turner is over to take a look. And no one can get there. It's a foul ball. Kershaw into the windup. Coming at him with the 0-1. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away, so now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. Swing and a miss as he starts the third, the same way he ended the second with a punch out, one away. Boy, that's the best pitch in baseball right there with two strikes. That elevated fastball. Every hitter thinks that, hey, they can do something with that, but most of the time, you get the result that you saw right there a big swing and a miss and another strikeout. 
At the plate now, Mike Yastrzemski, as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Here's the 0 1 pitch. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back to back. And this is swung on and missed. His fifth strikeout already. And there are two gone in the inning. Pretty impressive back to back strikeouts to start the inning. What's even more important is now he gets to face the middle of the order without anybody on base for them to drive in. And that'll bring up Buster Posey. Timing just a tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. 0 for 1 went down looking his first time up. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's 1 and 1. Fooled with the curveball there, and it's strike two. Two out, nobody on. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. And Lux is under it to make the catch and retire the side. Giants are down one, two, three, as they're unable to add to their two to one lead. Set for the start of the fourth, and next will be the speedy catcher, Will Smith. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And that misses for ball one. One oh home. Like to see him be looking to the opposite field with this next swing. Pitcher's trying to work you away. The two oh. Plain to see right there that the manager's sticking up for his hitter, making sure that that strike zone gets a little bit tighter. It's tough to cover both sides of the plate, and they both want that strike zone to be shrinked up a little bit. The 2 1. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? Action pitch right here, 2 2. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind the count 3 2. But this is yanked down out there at shortstop for the first out. The Chris Taylor. No one on with one down and in to hit next it'll be the ever versatile Chris Taylor. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. Fourth inning of a two to one ball game. Popped him up. Flores has a play and that's the second out of the inning. Next for the Dodgers A.J. Pollock looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Set and the pitch. And it's fouled away. Bases are empty here with two men out. Awfully close with the slider there, but it's one and one. And here's one that's taken for a ball. It's now two and one to the Dodger left fielder. 
There's not too many umpires in the game that are going to ring that first strike right there. That was borderline up, even though it was in the zone. The 2-1. Dodgers down to their final strike. Fouled away. Trying to send him packing for the second time. The bouncer to the left side. Fielded cleanly. Throw in time and the ball game is over. Very rarely are you going to win a game when you only collect two hits but you have to tip the cap. The pitching and defense carried him in this one. Pitching and defense game 2-1 to one, the final score this afternoon. San Francisco took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Kevin Gossman takes home the win. Clayton Kershaw worked only three innings in the losing effort. So that'll do it for us. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website, theshow.com. For this afternoon, first for the victorious Giants, two runs on just two hits, no errors.